Here we've got a Honda Pilot. This is a 2010 Honda Pilot and the key. Uh, unfortunately, the battery does not work on the key. Really kind of frustrating, but it's not hard to change. I'll just show you this. Locks the door, unlocks the door. So this is the key for the vehicle. It starts the car just fine and everything. We're gonna get this battery replaced so uh, the clicker works again. So here's the key. On the back, we've got a little screw. This is a great little tool kit. I'll include a link on Amazon where you can pick this up as well as a link for uh, the batteries that you'll need for your key. So let's get what we need. That. We're gonna want this one. So, you've got the little, the actual brains behind your key, right? This is just the case, obviously. Um, so on the ends here, there's a little tab. I don't know if you can quite see that on either of these ends. Use your fingernail or you could use uh, the tool. And lo and behold, here is our battery. CR 1616. All right, so your replacement battery is the CR 1616. Now I wanna give you a little hint. Um, buy these online. Uh, you can go to Amazon, get uh, several of these, usually a pack of two or four, five batteries for about five bucks, at least currently. Because I'm replacing this for my sister who's headed out of town, I just ran to the local store and paid five bucks just to get a single battery. So. Unless it's real urgent, you might as well get several so you got them. You can place them in all of your clickers or um, have these on hand for others. All right, the positive side right here goes down like that. Can be a little tricky to get in, but in place. And then you want to put it back together here. So pay attention how it came apart so it goes back together the right way. One side's longer than the other so you won't be able to mess it up. It should fit together pretty nicely. Okay, let's get this thing put back together. The screw conveniently has stayed in its spot. Turn it snap in place. And right, you'll feel this thing tighten down. Okay, got it. Yep. All right. So that's all back together. Let's go try it in the car. All right, so here we are. We replaced the battery. Can't really see the lights blink, but it unlocked the doors. <laughs> Push the panic button. Got that going. There, it locked it. Unlocked it. All right. Well, pretty easy to fix. Thanks so much for watching Tomahawk DIY. Leave a comment if this helped you, or if it wasn't helpful. I certainly appreciate if you buy the batteries through the affiliate link that I'll include in the video description. There's also a link to the tool set that I used. Hope this was helpful, and have a great day.